66 Sports with Mike Finner. Welcome on, it's time for sports. We continue our local District 10 playoff coverage with girls soccer action in Class 2A tonight. Four quarterfinals to get to to Fairview's Keck Field at Jack Bestwick Stadium, Harbor Creek and Cathedral Prep. Getting it going here, scoreless early in the first chance here for the Huskies. Gabriela Licata, that goes wide later. Preps Olivia Dixon fires one up ahead, and it's Brooklyn Duremo scoring the Rambler goal in front. Prep takes the lead 1-0. Dixon would score not long after as Prep goes on to win 4-1 to advance to the District 10 semifinals. Two Cathedral Preps, Dollinger Field, Fort LaBeouf, and Corey in another D10 2A girls soccer quarterfinal. First half action, LaBeouf opens the scoring on this shot. From distance, Emily Samluck powers one through the back of the net. one nothing. LaBeouf. About 20 minutes later in the match, it's Ashley Freeze with the game's second goal as the Bison double up that lead for the girls in blue. Still in the first, the ball will spit out and it'll get to the foot of here, Haley Will. She'll find the back of the net here for the lead of 3-0 as Fort LaBeouf continues to extend its advantage. Just a couple of minutes later, Will will do it again, and it's 4-0 Fort LaBeouf with the lead. Before the half not finished, Freeze will pick up her second of the night, makes it 5 nothing, as she finds the back of the net. And then finally, Jenna Papowski will make it 6-0 before halftime as Fort LaBeouf cruises to a win in the quarterfinal round. They go on to win 9-0 as they defeat Corey to advance to the D10 2A semifinals. I think there's just a, a real mental toughness with our girls that come out, even in the big games. They, they're just really confident. They continue to play for each other. And uh, just a great start tonight, for sure. We all just played together. We passed a feat, and we just had a really good last 10 minutes of the first half. We got all those goals right there and then, and just left us playing well in the second half. More action. First game in Fairview's Keck Field. General McLean and Grove City into a quarterfinal action late. Late in this one, though, we still got it. Lancers leading 3-0, taking a corner. No dice for a fourth goal there. The Lancers go on to get the win, however, as General McLean advances, topping Grove City by a final of 3 to nothing. Back to Dollinger Field, Katie Scott and Fairview taking on Northeast in D10 to a quarterfinal action. Early on in this one, it was Isabel Owens scoring for Fairview, makes it one nothing. less than three minutes in here in the action. Later in the first half, Tigers with it again. And it'll be Owens again coming up here to score to make it 2-0. Tigers, Fairview adds one in the second, and they go on to win 3-0, advancing to the quarterfinals with the win over the Great Pickers. And two of tonight's D10 3A girls volleyball quarterfinals at Cochranton, Cathedral Prep over Grove City in four sets. Conneaut sweeps Hickory, both Meadville and Warren receiving buys.